First of all, I'd like to point out that I'm not a huge fan of the new PSN store software. Um, pretty much you have to know exactly what you're looking for in order to find it now with the uh, new software. I mean, you can just browse new releases, but it takes like several more clicks than it used to. Under the old software, you could just, you know, go in there right away, click, click on what's new, and then see all the new shit that was added in the last week, and it took five seconds. Now it takes like 25 seconds. Point being, the older software was much easier to use, more user-friendly, but that's my opinion. Oh well. What can you do? Honestly, what I would rather see them do is update the XMB so it was like, you know, not so dated. I mean, you guys look at this XMD, it's horrendously outdated. This needs a major overhaul. But <laughs> that, that, that seems to be getting, you know, ignored. That's probably nothing that's gonna, they're not even probably gonna touch that until they release their next console. I don't know, but that's what I'd like to see. Anyway, hopefully this session I'll get my field test of ghost armor. Yes, that would be beneficial. Because as of right now, I have no fucking idea what it does. You know, it just tells me that it enables you to cloak or something. I and mean, it sounds fucking cool. But until I can actually get in the field and use it, I won't know. Okay, I have a whole bunch of money. I can't remember what I was doing. I haven't played the game since Thursday. It's Monday. Uh, I only have three sets of it. Yeah, it should be enough. Uh, what about my other guns? I probably need more of these guns. Ah, uh, yeah. A lot of alloys. I'm low on Illyria now. I need to shoot down more UFOs. That's what I need. Uh-huh. I am way low on Illyrium, otherwise I'd make more of this shit. Because look at how much this shit costs. It just burns it right up. 36, 24, yeah. Should I build a shiv? I probably will eventually just to get the damn trophy for it. <laughs> I'm in no hurry right now. Let's go to the foundry. Ah, oh, yeah. Improved art. Advanced flight is what I'm looking for, but boy, will that just drain me really bad. Improved pistol, too. How about this one? Increase aim with pistols. And this one does a damage increase, I think. Yep, that's a damage increase. Well, let's get two first. Yep. That didn't affect me too badly. The foundry is already warmed up. I'll make sure to notify you as soon as production is finished. Okay, thank you, Doctor. All oh, right, I have no research available because I have done everything. Yes, everything's done. Up until this point. I mean, look at all this shit of research, but I'm sure there's still going to be more projects for them. Hyperwave relay is a priority. My power is kind of in the yellow, but oh well. Go for it. All right. Yeah, I notice there's a little bit of it, there's, the, there's a little bit of a hang up when you zoom out of the building screen. Probably because I have so many facilities, though. I'm just assuming. Do I want to test anyone? Uh, probably not yet. I need to power up these people a little bit more first. Uh huh. I don't have this yet. Let's buy it. There goes all my money. Okay, but it needed to be done. Something Additional happened, workshop please. Online. Okay, I got some money back. Yay. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. 
We're always glad to have more help down here. I have 93 engineers now. That's badass. Went over a threshold, so let's see if it reduced costs any, any at all. Mm, a little bit. I think that was 16 before and 20. Yeah, it did. It reduced the cost of ghost armor, because I know that was 36 and something else. And Archangel was like 25 or 26. So yeah, it is reducing cost with more engineers, but you know, like, you know, Firestorm's cost me like nothing to make now. That's ridiculous. <laughs> hey, what the hell? It only takes 12 alloys? Okay. <laughs> How big are these pieces of alien alloy? I mean, they have to be like, you know, the size of a human body in order to make a firestorm with just 12 of them. Just throwing that out there. Something happened, please. Firestorms are done awesome. I think I've, hey, look at that. I got shit back. That's cool. I got money again. I, I'm really happy about the Illyrium return on that one, honestly. Hanger. Okay, we got to rearm these guys. Plasma can All right. I could probably get rid of some of these ravens too now that I have all of these fucking firestorms. <laughs> South America needs one, and Africa needs one. Once again, that hangar's glitched, that one to the left. Whatever. Let's rearm my ships. Whoa. I didn't even see that. I got a workshop rebate of some sort, but I pressed the wrong... I wanted to cancel out. Oh, well. Shit happens. Uh, yeah, I did. I get some money back. That's what we're gonna do. Transport. Move ships. You go to South America. Five, you will go to who else needs it? Africa. There. I have a firestorm in every continent. That's good enough for me. Still haven't used one yet. I'm dead serious. I built the very first firestorm in what, August? And I have not gotten to shoot down a UFO with one yet. They've all either been on the ground already or uh yeah, I just haven't gotten to shoot one down yet. It's kinda irritating. Let me use one of those damn things. Okay. <laughs> I'll make those for three more engineers, sure. Uh, well, two scopes? Okay, gee, that's real fucking hard to deal with. That's $20. Ooh, I don't know if I can afford that. Here you go, guys. Send me some more engineers. That's another five threshold, by the way. The new engineers so that will reduce costs morning, again. We're always glad to have more help down here. Yeah, I did. Ghost Armor went down a whopping one dollar in its cost. <laughs> I can still make Titan Armor. Yeah, that's cheaper than shit now. I think the Firestorm went down a dollar also. I can make all this shit. Yeah, because you know what? It costs nothing. Okay, could something happen, please? Aircraft transfer complete. Probably won't happen until I get the hyperwave relay built, which I just did. See all, know all. Hyperwave uplink online. Thanks for the alloys back. Well, the money's nice too, but you know. I might have to put a power generator in here. Hey, what about an Illyrium generator? What's that going to cost? Insufficient funds, okay. I don't need power right now. I mean, I've only got three slots open to build shit, but... Yeah. Okay. Something happened. 13 days till the council report. I haven't even gone on a mission yet, I don't think. Oh, it's 
Wait, picking up something. What did you do? Shut it down. Do not touch anything. This could be what we've been waiting for. to have paid off, but we've endangered the lives of everyone involved to satisfy the doctor's curiosity. The risk was worth the reward. If we hadn't pushed on, there's no way we would have gotten this information. Whatever, get a fucking firestorm on it. Like, now. I can finally get to see it launch. Nice, it's BTOL. That's cool. Yeah, that takes off at like Mach never. Engaging bogey. Okay. Increases defense. My accuracy. See ya. Man. Pretty big ship, I imagine. Remind me, yeah, I better make more of those aim and dodge bows. Okay. Ethereals, huh? Nice. It's the hyperwaves tell relays telling you what aliens are in the ship. Ah, uh, yeah. Ethereals are like the granddaddy of the aliens. I remember them from the earlier games. They are like the most powerful. You, know, you thought these muton elites were tough and the sectopods were tough. No, no. The ethereals make them all look like a bunch of pussies. So. We're gonna send the Sky Ranger, but before we do that, we're gonna field test our new armor. All right. I might have to take these sergeants out, bring in some people that are really good for this job. Yeah, actually, I'll leave Deadbolt in. Get him leveled up. Good, Angel's back. Uh, let's see. I need another assault, Colonel. Uh, yeah, there's one. There's my psychic, the psionic. <laughs> yeah, okay. Let's see here. Yeah, this is gonna work. Yeah, put on that shit. The troops should have no trouble handling recon duty as long as they're equipped with this suit. Nice. It's as close as we've come to true invisibility. Okay. Yeah. Stealth camo and plasma weapons. Where have we seen this before? Yeah. Good. Let's see. Where am I assault? Yeah, okay, um, I'm probably going to put her in it, too. Uh, back to default gear? Yeah, we got to change that, like, right now. Pipe armor. Scatter laser works. Infinite alien. I have infinite alien grenades now, by the way. That should be worth pointing out. Why is he carrying an alien grenade? That's just no, no good to me. <laughs> I suppose because I, I'm going to have him flying, so that wouldn't be bad. 
two units with med kits. Yes. Okay. Let's let's go get the let's go get these aliens and take out their their big boss man. Germany? Looks like it. Yep. Our target site is near the German border. It looks like the aliens went down in a sparsely populated area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. Yeah, they probably will. Especially since uh, they've known for some time now what the aliens have been doing. Unless, you know, people living out in the backwoods of Germany don't have TVs, but you never know. Launch mission. I'll just go ahead and land right here, right by it. No, no problem. They've been protecting this ship with their most advanced technology. So it's safe to assume whatever they've gotten there is crucial to their invasion effort. We should expect heavy resistance. They're not going to make this easy on us. Why would they? <laughs> 